The smell of your breath, and even more specifically, the smell of your nose breath, the that shit is good that has me in a chokehold literally in a chokehold i will tell you to just breathe out so i can inhale nice hands belma oh moisturized smooth skin like oh it's just it's just hot but like, i don't know why it's just hot i walk up in the morning and i say i need one of those they got me trying out their clothes What's good YouTube? Whenever wherever you're watching this video, I appreciate you for spending your time right here, right now. Now in today's video, I'm going to be explaining how to actually become more attractive to women. Before we get into the video, I want to say I appreciate all the new supporters, all the supporters who've been on the channel from the start. Welcome to the channel if you are new, and let's get straight into the video. Now guys, quick disclaimer before we get into the video, this is not going to be the general get in shape to get more women or get more money to get more women. This is not gonna be the general surface level stuff, guys. We're gonna get into some of the dark realities of what women actually find attractive. So if you're thinking this is just lift some more weights and you're gonna get more women, no, we're, gonna, we're actually gonna go deep into what women find attractive and how to become more attractive to more women. Now guys, first thing first, you have to become the guy you are trying to be. Now, what do I mean by that? A lot of you guys maybe walk into a room, you're trying to portray a certain image. A lot of you guys out there are guessing. You're guessing when it comes to becoming attractive for women. You're guessing, you're trying to be somebody who, you know deep down inside, you're not, you're not really that person. You know you're not that person, but you're trying to be that person. Guys, once I realized in my personal life, Stop trying to become the guy. Stop trying to become him. Stop trying to do things that you think women will find impressive. Stop trying to become him. Actually be that guy. Be somebody women want to be around. A lot of you guys are trying to portray an image like you're somebody who women want to be around. Stop doing that. How about you actually become somebody who women naturally want to be around? And then it's not going to be so much guessing because if you're naturally being yourself, you're this guy who women naturally want to come around. There's not this this guessing. You're not playing these guessing games. But if you're somebody who's not someone women want to truly come around, but you're trying to portray the image of being somebody women want to truly come around, what's going to happen is you're going to be playing a lot of guessing games, which a lot of you guys are out there doing. You're guessing. Should I do that? Should I, should I do this? Should I do that? But if you actually become the guy, you don't have to play these guessing games. You have to become desirable to other women. Let me explain something to you. You can lift as many weights as you want. You can watch as many mouthpiece videos as you want. You could make as much money as you want. But guys, if you are still undesirable to women after doing all those things, if you're still unable to attract other women, have social proof after doing all those things, it's irrelevant. Take somebody like Pete Davidson, for example, right? Pete Davidson, it doesn't even have to be specifically be him. Just a guy who we know is not really attractive to women generally based off his facial features etc but somebody who's still able to attract women even though he's, he doesn't look a certain type of way right the reason someone like pete davidson who people would look at and say he's not somebody who's objectively attractive the reason pete davidson is still able to attract women good looking women too you know what I'm saying? He was just with Kim Kardashian, took Kim Kardashian off of Kanye, had Kanye looking crazy. The reason Pete Davidson is able to do this is because he has social proof. He's desirable to other women. When women see you're desirable to other women, they're automatically attracted to you. Now guys, last but not least, how to become attractive to more women. Last but not least, you've got to realize that when you have a purpose, a hobby, a passion, you're gonna become very attractive to women. Whether you're a singer, whether you're a sports player, when you have a hobby or something you're very passionate about, maybe it's, it's your profession. If you're very passionate about this thing, you've got to realize it's going to attract women. Let me explain why. When a woman sees that you have something that you care about more than her, something that you go towards every day, for example, it, you may have experienced a situation or know somebody who's experienced a situation where a guy's going off to the gym and his girl's begging him to stay and cuddle inside and watch Netflix. The reason she doesn't like that, she's telling you to stay. She doesn't like the fact that you're leaving because you have something that you care about more than her. You have something that you actually want to be dedicated towards and more than her. You don't want to stay in bed with her, lying in bed just watching Netflix. You have something that you care about more than her. Guys, I'm telling you, find a hobby, purpose or passion. 
You've got to realize when you have these things in place, and you're really dedicated to these things, it's gonna make women crave you more. Women like to see a man who is passionate about his purpose, hobbies, etc. Now guys, we've reached the end of the video. Whenever, wherever you did watch this video, I appreciate you for spending your time right here, right now. If you enjoyed the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll make sure to see you on the next one. I'm out.